Hello and welcome to a Master System Let's Play. This is Back to the Future Part 3. Um, as if you've seen the previous episode, where I did Part 2, you'll know that my expectations, and yours should also be, very low. Hopefully this one is playable. So I press start to play, and <laughs> oh man, what have they done to his eyes? What's wrong with Michael J. Fox? The bot goes out of control, it's heading for the ravine. Okay, so if you know the plot of the film, uh, Clara Clayton is in a, um, a wagon, and there's a snake or something, and it, you know, spooks her, and I guess we have to chase after her, but I don't remember there being huge amounts of vultures, or... Kind of, is that a tomahawk? Okay. Okay, I don't know who that was. Clearly taking a lot of liberties with the license. Anyway. You see along the bottom there's a map. Whoa! <laughs> you didn't reach Clara. Ah! Uh, <laughs> the horse in the corner. <laughs> oh man, he lies Clara Clayton died. Teacher for a day fell into Clayton Ravine. Forget it doc, I'll do it. No, no, I'll try again. Okay, so we've got more than one life. I have to say that compared to Back to Future Part 2, this is actually playable, although it's quite difficult. Ah! You need to duck there and not jump. Seems to be fairly generous in terms of... Uh... Oh, you know, being able to just die. Ah! Okay, so I can't duck the uh, tomahawk things flying at me. Oh, alright, so the horse doesn't want to jump that. Okay, so I think I'm just being a bit late on the jump. Oh. I didn't reach Clara. I wish I was Mary Poppins. Here lies Clara Clayton. Yep. Getting a bit saddle sore, but it's worth another try. Yeah, is it though? I really think for such a rich and interesting story and franchise that the Battles of the Future series didn't really get its, uh, didn't really get the respect it deserves on the Master System. Ah! Hey, I made it. Oh, but not twice. Didn't reach Clara. Ah! I'm wondering what's the limit here. Am I going to just be able to do this forever? I kind of want to. Get it, Doc. I'll do it. No, no, I'll try again. Yeah, this is playable to the point where I want to try. I'm not sure what... Was that like an umbrella? I'm wondering if I'm supposed to pick them up. Ah. The controls are a bit odd. But not certainly not as bad as Bats of the Future 2. Any good reactions for some of the shots? I don't know what a B is. Hey, you made it. Right. The uh, extra jump to do. Yay! Okay, so a bit of memorization. You can actually get past that. 
know what a green boulder was. Giant Brussels sprout or something. Oh, that's a hat. An umbrella. Oh, okay, so perhaps we have to rescue all this stuff. A bit weird, because we can just go back and get that later. I wish I was Mary Poppins. Well, what a weird thing to say. I'm gonna hope that. What? Die bomb by a vulture. Ooh. Harsh. So, in the bottom right hand corner, there's an old fashioned clock, and I think that's ticking up, and when it hits the top, we lose. Wasting time getting shot at. Come on. Do those jumps really early. Oh, and then duck straight away for that. You really need a good memory for this level. Oh. Well, whereas the previous one, I kind of stopped playing because it was just awful. I actually think I might not be able to get much further than that. Oh. <laughs> Dying very quickly this time. I had a feeling there was someone creeping up on me. Oh. Put his hand up to grab it, but whoa. Concentrate on jumping. I've got the feeling that I'm not really missing out on a particularly amazing title here, but it's kind of annoying that I'm trying to let's play this and to uh, show you some of it. And actually, I'm not really showing you very much at all. Or perhaps I'm showing you everything you need to see. Oh. This definitely requires a lot of memorization. Ah. Bad luck. Able to collect the B. Jump. And then we've got another jump coming. And then a boulder to duck. Okay, furthest we've ever been, I think. Oh the bird's what what's that bird doing? Ah yeah. oh. Didn't reach Clara. So, based on the second part two, I should say, the first game, but part two, I'm wondering if there's all sorts of different sort of mini-games. I can imagine there'd be quite a few, um, you know, gunfighting parts and, you know, there's a frisbee bit and some dancing maybe, I don't know. I could probably imagine some kind of mini-games, but really I have no idea. What I might do is just leave it on the title screen and see what happens. Um, part 2 had sort of little previews of all the levels, so we'll at least be able to see what we missed. And if you're really interested, obviously you can uh, find a copy of this, and probably quite cheap. And uh, see what it's like yourself. appear to be a way to quit, so what I'll probably do is just reset. Ah. I 
because unfortunately my skills just aren't good enough to uh, get very far on this. And I'm sorry Clara, but I'm afraid it's going to be Clayton Ravine this time. Okay, so I'm going to reset. Yes. And we'll just watch the uh, intro for a bit and see if there's a some kind of a track mode or... I don't know. I might end up editing this bit out of the video. It's all the same people as uh, part two, I think. Certainly image works and probe are familiar. I'm not really a big fan of the music, this one. It's alright, but it's very... Uh, it's taking a lot of liberties with the theme tune. Okay, so I won't press start to play, I'll just watch it. Okay, so this is the demo. Okay, <laughs> so the guy playing the demo isn't any good at it either. Ah. Maybe they didn't make any other levels. Maybe that one's just purposely impossible. And this definitely feels like a game. The second part two was just weird and broken. This one has sort of physics. And, oh, here we go. Right, so it's a ah, I like an isometric. Oh, you got you got the frisbees. I can already tell you I'd be terrible at this, so you're not missing much by me not getting this far. So I think I will call this an episode, um, if you'd like, on your own time, feel free to uh, see what the rest of the game's like. Um, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.